just, cold just being steel. good today. It was cold as ice. <laughs> <laughs> Freak. Thanks. <laughs>set up the beacon to emit an amplified sonic burst. So set it off and all the cybermats in the station go bang. Afraid it's not quite that simple. To make sure we take out as many cybermats as possible, we have to drop it right head. into their nest. And mm -hmm. where is the nest? That is what we need to find out. Terrific. Terrific. Terrific, mate. Oh, look, there's one on a chair. Oh, he's the ex doctor, which is. Or something, whatever his second name is, figures with M. If that's what you're on about. <laughs> he always has weird gay hair that is better in the next, the, like, the other part of when he was, you can get me. It's not there anymore, is it? Fantastic. Fantastic. <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do a normal accent, so I'm not going to try and do it in a normal accent. <laughs> we'll go through there. Oh, the medikits. Oh, examine. Can you hear that? The cybermats are in the air ducting system. It services the whole base, so they'll be everywhere. Sneaky devils, aren't they? Can we get them through here? Too dangerous. If I open this hatch, whoosh. Do you fancy getting covered in cybermats? Yes. Best to get them <laughs> yes, through the bar. <laughs> You're going through the vent system. Am I wearing a Bruce Willis vest? Besides, I won't fit. There's another vent hatch up there. If I distract them from down here, you might be able to open it. Me? Sorry. I'm not really ventilation duct size. I <laughs> can distract them for you with the sonic screwdriver. Hmm, it's a plan, I suppose. Take the beacon, climb up there, and while I keep the cybermats occupied with the sonic, see if you can open the vent up there. Okay, I think I can manage that. Uh, and um, try to avoid oh, any cybermats while you're up there. Thanks! Doctor of the Flaming Obvious now, are you? I mean it, they're dangerous. You know what they can do. Hmm. Terrific. <laughs> I thought you were capturing. Doctor, <laughs> I see the nest. I'm setting off the beacon. Oh, I thought we were going to have to beat her. Good. No, I think you spoke too soon. Oh, no. Amy! She's on the other side. It's all right, I'm fine. There's a hand behind her. Then oh, Christ. Oh, not. she just landed on one, didn't she? What's that? Ah! <laughs> Sorry, I thought you were there. Anything here? I think you're going to have to use the door, whatever that. Oh, oh. Let's go outside over there. Oh, oh Amy! Oh, ah! oh, well, she's dead. That's all over now. <laughs> <laughs> it's good, isn't it? <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. You've got to put that on and then. Right, quick, get her. Pond. That is definitely handy. Okay, quick, click the button. No, I'll do it. Why? This is going to come round and kill me. Always good to do it at the same time, isn't he? Okay. On and Sorry, Cyberman. Slave. Amy! Amy, are you alright? Amy! Amy! Are you alright, Amy? Never alright, but you want a job doing. Changing a plug, sorting out a cyber slave. I don't know why I, I was know, ever worried about it. <laughs> Number one. <laughs> it's not as many as last time. What? <laughs> Are we looking at the uh, cyber slave doctor? Nope. What's that? Nope. Someone's hand. Perfect. Nano a nano synthesizer, just what Professor Meadows needs. She can get a sample of the cyber virus from this. Come on. Perfect. Oh. Let's examine the cyber slave. That's all to GSO Zebra Bay. Fort Cecil to GSO Zebra Bay. Do you read me? Confirming supply delivery. What? They can't, they can't come here. We have to stop them. Fort Cecil, this is GSO Zebra Bay. Stay away. Do you hear me? Stay away. Do you read us? Oh. It's not working. No. The capacitor's blown. Like that means anything to me. <laughs> Look, <laughs> this is it. Always what happens. I have to get back oh. to Professor Meadows. 
find another capacitor, Amy, get the radio working again and warn Fort Cecil. And now I'm a radio engineer. Great. Makes me want to sing a song, but I'm not quite sure what. What? I don't know. Meadows. There's no more buttons on the keyboard. Oh, I get fat cyber boiler. Let's do it. Uh oh, Dalek. Dalek firepower. Dalek. Okay. Um, Pond's face scared me then. She's a scary woman. She is. We can go through there. Do do. Oh, look, there's one convenient to be placed in the. Oh, yeah, we are a jelly baby again. Oh, yeah, those are ras um, raspberries. <laughs> jelly baby. <laughs> jelly baby. <laughs> so, suddenly got like. That's nice. I want a code. Oh, so we're going to talk to Crimson now. Is that his name? Crimson. Oh. <laughs> Chisholm. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> I call him Crimslow. Okay. <laughs> Go back to Crimslow. It's not very big this base, is it? Right, after it's like cut off. You having a problem controlling the pond? Yeah, she kept wanting to walk into the ward. Crimslow. Hello, Mr. Chisholm. Are you there? Why Chisholm. are you still here? I need to ask you a question. Not very nice man, is he? Oh, I Pass to radio. How are you? How are you? How are you doing in there? It's getting worse. You'd better get away. No, he's good the doctor will help you. I know he will. You think so? I saw what happened to my friends. And I know. <laughs> Mr. Chisholm? Crimslow. Do you know where I can find a capacitor <laughs> for the radio? It's broken oh, and we need like to warn Cecil. There's a spare one in my locker. Oh, there you go. Oh. The code is 3245. Remember that? Thank you! For, well, don't need to. <laughs> Thank you! just does it itself. 3245. Oh, well, this is Amy. It might not happen. Amy, 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 there you go. The capacitor. And now we go to the doctor and take the capacitor. Let's go to the doctor, doctor, doctor. <laughs> Let's go to the doctor, doctor. <laughs> Let's have a little sing song. What is in here? Oh, past the door. Wait, yeah. Where's Winslow gone? Meadows. <laughs> you would name. <laughs> I've got to the bug of this. What was that? To the radio. Do I have the radio? No. Where's oh, the radio? the radio in the other room where they came through. Fact. Cyberman. Um. Wait, which one was it? The, where they were talking to us through the radio. Where we were just a minute ago in the. Um, what in this one? Yeah. Through there. Attach it to the radio, watch the Cyberman. Oh. Cool. <laughs> and now go in for oh, your infantry. Oh. Oh. Where was this supposed to go? Distracted by ah, head, like I see it. Weirdness. There. Be <coughs> scary if that thing comes up now. Connection. It's moving. Um, uh, the GSO to Fort Cecil. Hello? Roger and all that. <laughs> Roger and all that. This is Fort Cecil reading you. Are you confirming the delivery? The no, we have a, a, a situation <laughs> here. We need you to hold off on that delivery. Don't come anywhere near here until we give you the green light. Is that clear? Why? What, what is happening? Don't um, wanna know, mate. Polar flu. Really, really bad outbreak. We need Polar to be quarantined just really? to be safe. Roger that. Let us know if we can help. Roger. Thanks. GSO out. GSO. Will we find out really what GSO safe? is? No. Now, where did the doctor get to? Where did the doctor get to? Professor Meadows? Elizabeth? She's gone. When I said stay She's here, gone. I don't need to just know it. <laughs> Did we just go in there? Yeah, <laughs> you noticed she wasn't there. Well, Amy just went let's in there see what as I well. can do about this serum. Pretty sure you had. Good for Um, so if I want to do something here, or um, go to the, 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 the no, the other one. No. Yeah. No. Ah, the doctor is going to examine it. Oh, I take the colours in the top right corner using the green button as the circling balls. <laughs> We'll take one of any colour they pass under. Match all the conditions in the top mm -hmm. and we will to succeed. Terrific. 
No, oh, well, this is marvellous, isn't it? So what? You need more purples than blues, look, apparently. Can you move it again? There you go. Better get it. Better get it. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, and then change it now. Oh, that was easy. They do make up some really strange Very random weird. things. Now to synthesise the serum. So you need more blues than oranges, but as many oranges as greens. Oh god. Okay, some more blues. Oh, don't change anything. So you need more blue, more blue than orange, but as many. Oh, what? Okay, let me just make all the outsides green. And then as many blue as orange. Oh, You're great, just no, changing them to pink. Blue is orange. More blue than orange. I'm so confused. <laughs> <laughs> so you need more I mean, you need more blues than there are oranges, but then as many uh, oranges as green, so So you need like all of them so to be three. literally need all of them to be blues apart from say like one orange and one green. Get me? Thank you. I'll just dull without you. <laughs> <laughs> ah, hey, look. One synthesized nano serum. Who's a clever boy then? Yeah? Well I fixed the radio and warned Fort Cecil. You're not the only brain box around here. We managed it. Brilliant. We can't allow anyone to get near this place. <laughs> Cybermen's bad enough. But those Cybermen under the ice are something like, else entirely. Totally. We need to yeah. find out how close the Cyber Slaves are to releasing the Cybermen and hope there's still time to stop them. All right. Is that We're staring those? straight ahead? I don't know. When I got back, she'd gone. She's I don't like that at all. In. We should get the serum to Chisholm. You're right. First things first. Chris, Crimslow. <laughs> Crimslow, let's go. <laughs> to Crimslow. Um, I've lost my bearings. That's Straight here. ahead. Straight into the thing. Into the door. To Crimslow. To make him better. Crimslow, my dear. I've developed a serum. It will reverse the nanovirus. Yeah, it was Please come down and take it. <laughs> Are you sure it'll work? Uh -oh. I've seen what happened to the others. Oh, I don't cry. end up like that. I'd rather be dead. I can't That's be sure horrible. how it will take to work, mm -hmm. but believe me. You're going to be all right. Of course. Did you find Meadows? Yes, but now she's disappeared. Had she been infected? Apart from an injured arm, she seemed fine. That's so creepy. But now I can't find her on the base. Any idea where she could have gone? Only the excavation. But that's where the cyber slaves are digging, isn't it? She's got to be mad. This whole project is hers. This is her team. She would do anything to save them. How do we get to the excavation? Are going to change back? In the lab. Yes, I saw that. But the door had a heavy security lock. I'll get us past that. Oh God, we got our cyber it's a closed man. Environment. There's a retinal oh, scanner. Oh, he is going. He goes down there. He's a ghost. Oh, 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 oh! I don't think you're going any further. Why is Let it the always falling on the floor? <laughs> I can handle things from here. I can handle. Them. Going down for household appliances and homicidal cybermen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you are so <laughs> funny. I really just just Cold being steel. good today. It was cold as ice. <laughs> Freak. Thanks. <laughs> oh, you gotta hear them walking. Careful. This, one, don't this place is crawling with cyber stuff. slaves. Looks like a network of tunnels. Why dig all those? Standard procedure in digs. You dig a cross pattern of trenches, or in this case, tunnels, until you we find actually what you're real looking for. Where? And they found it. They weren't looking for what they found. If only they had never started to look. They're on the loading screen, look. so send them a real sight of the sea. Nope. 